I had to take a look at this military base, guys. We are. This is where the fat guy came that time. So if you want to go and die for a country that doesn't care, there's the number you'll need. God bless the servicemen and women though who actually look after us. I want to take a little, there's some really nice army vehicles in there. We'll try and get a picture of some of them. That's cool. I was just taking a picture of that uh, truck. Oh, because it's an army place, you're not supposed to take photos. Oh, no, 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 it's okay because I'm on public land. So I can take photos of anything I can see from public land so long as I don't come on to private land. It's true, you can check the law if you like. Can I get permission to come in? No. <laughs> I thought you might have said that. <laughs> Why? What you got to hide in there? The law on that one. Yeah, no, I know. I, well, I'm allowed to come in if I get permission, but I'm not going to just come in. What is it? Army cadets, or is it just cadets? Ah, yeah. uh, you close the gate so I can get a picture. Support, uh, support battalion as well, electrical. Can I at least ask one? Yeah, just making a documentary, that's all. It's a little documentary. It's no hostile reconnaissance, don't worry. I, I'm not being very covert if I was engaged in that anyway, am I? Yeah. Right, <laughs> Cheers, mate, have a nice day. Uh, what were they saying? Yeah, servicemen. So, yeah, thank you, servicemen and women. I appreciate it, even if your country doesn't. But yeah, so this is the military base anyway, which the fat guy distracted me from last time. So we'll have a quick look. We're a little further down as well that we can see some of the other army vehicles, which seem to be quite cool. It's not really much you can see from this gate, so we'll take a little stroll along, see what we can see. some more there. I'd actually drive one of those as my car. I would. Here's that vehicle I was talking about just now. Give a little look, that's cool. Sorry about the shakiness again. Well, we didn't really get, it didn't really stop shaking last time, did it? That gimbal I got wasn't great and it broke on my first use. So it's been sent back and hopefully we'll have another one soon. A little bit of a better one, one that can actually work. Can I ask why you're filming in there? Sorry, who are you? I'll be, I'll work there. Well, how do I know that? You look you've just watched me walk, you've just watched me drive out of freaking camp. I'm not watching you, am I? In fact, why are you filming inside there? Why are you being so aggressive? Because that's a MOD building. So that means that you need to be aggressive? I'm not being aggressive. You I'm are? asking you. Why I do. Are you a police constable? No. Then I'm what right do you have to ask me? In the British Army. Okay, so do you know the law then, do you? You're not allowed to film me. What law says I can't? Eh? What law says I can't? Well, we'll see. When Can I have your details then? What for? Can I have your details? Yeah, of course you can. Go on then. My name's Fauzi Shard in Peru. I live at 100. Date of birth? Why? Because that's what you're going to expect from me. I don't want your date of birth. I just want your name. 
and, wh and why you are filming there. You're not supposed to be filming MOD properly. Says who? Well, look at the threat levels. Look, threat of what? Threat from terrorist, a camera? No, terrorist attack. You oh, could be you could be on a recce. I don't know who you are. In fact, serious question, right? Okay, because you don't cross me as a silly, as a, as a stupid man, right? But if I was engaged in hostile reconnaissance, would I be stood right outside the front, wearing what I'm wearing? It like, if, anybody. Uh, come on, anybody. if you're going to do hostile reconnaissance, you, you do it covertly, not overtly. Hostile, though, do you? Huh? All I want to know is why you're filming inside that building. Because I can. But why then? And I wasn't filming inside a building. You haven't well, even you asked me. Filming inside that property. You asked me what. You haven't even asked me what I was filming. Well, what are you filming then? I was Grass. filming. I oh, know. I was filming the military vehicles that are in there actually. Well, there's no military. You can't see yeah. any military vehicles. There's two. There's a military vehicle up there. A green one. A there's, land a, over. there's a military vehicle over there. Yeah, but why? With, are you with trailers. Like, there's two military vehicles there. So why are you filming it's, them for? It's then? interesting. Why is it interesting? Because it's not often that you get to see stuff like this, is it? So, do you not think it would have been prudent if you asked if you do that? Ask, well, ask why? What for? for? Ask for what reason? Well, though? you stopped at the door there. I know. And you looked at the bell. But yeah. You didn't bother ringing or asking I anybody. I know because I didn't need anybody. I don't need anybody to help me make a video. So why are you doing the video? What's the video for? For me. Yeah, but what for? For my own purposes. Why? Really? I just told you. Yeah, but I want to know why. Yeah, but I want to know the lottery numbers for this so weekend. When, if I, so in two weeks' time, if this place gets attacked... When? Are you planning I to attack in it? in two years' time. I said in about two weeks' time, if this place gets attacked, what am I supposed to think if I've not reported it? I'll tell you what, right? If this place gets attacked in two weeks' time, what you can do is you can contact me and say, excuse me, sir, you were doing a perfectly legal and reasonable activity the other day, yeah, and then I our base was attacked legal. after. So, yeah, but I wonder if we can see your footage, just in case you might have caught something. And then, at that point, I say, yeah, of course. Yeah, but surely, if, if you want to film military vehicles mm -hmm. over there, all right, and you looked at the doorbell, mm -hmm. why didn't you just ring the doorbell and ask if you could film it? Because and then the, someone could have escorted you within the camp and I'll you could have took it. I'll tell you why. Because the guy on the Triumph who came out, the guy who rides the, the Triumph motorbike, came out first and told me I wouldn't be allowed in. So why am I going to ring the yeah, bell after he's told me? form of ID? What do I need ID for? If you wanted to come into camp. Why would I need ID to film in, inside there? Because you, that's a military premises. I know it is. That's why I was filming it. So you're filming military vehicles on the military premises? Yeah. Looking suspicious. What's suspicious about me, because sir? you're walking with a camera. Yeah, I know, but Do what's you know suspicious what I mean? about that? You've got a camera on you. Have I? Yeah. Where? And your phone. Where's my phone? In your bag. No, it's not. It's in there. Well, how do I know that? It looks suspicious. Well, I don't care We're how it looks. We're in the looks. army. We get threat levels given to us every single day of what to look out for and stuff like so that. So you get told to look out for people with cameras? Well, yeah. So you stop everybody... Especially when you're pointing a camera in there and filming. Yeah, exactly like that. But I'm allowed to do that. Um, yeah, but I'm asking you why you're doing it. And I've told you, because I can. All right, fair enough. <laughs> right, can I have your details? Then? No, absolutely not. Why? Because I don't have to give them to you. So you've been obstructed then? By exercising my rights as being obstructive? No, you're just being obstructive. By exercising my rights as yeah, being obstructive? Yeah, obstructive. You're how, being what obstructive. Am I, how am I being obstructive? Because I'm what am I obstructing you from, you sir? Details. Yeah, I know, but you didn't have to. Yeah, but you're making me feel uncomfortable while right. filming inside there. Why? Because you're not supposed to. But what's making you feel be specific? You because can't just be vague. You've been, having, you've been saying to me that I haven't told be, you because I've been being vague. It could be an open recce, all right? Yeah. You could be just doing a recce. It could be, you, yeah. You could be then put that You know reconnaissance is not a crime, right? And say, oh, look at this. Look at this phone number and belt. Look at the people who've just come in and out of this camp. I did I did video I did video the phone number and I did point out the video the phone so number. Why did you do that then? Because I said if you guys want to go and die for a country that doesn't give a shit about you, this I'm is the number to call. But you just asked that. me why I filmed it. And then when I told you why I filmed it, oh there's my mate in the T T look. That's my mate in the T yeah. Wave to him. Alright! Alright! That's my mate that is. He knows me. Saw me here last time when I was filming it. Aren't you going to say bye? You're not going to say goodbye? <laughs> right, that's that then, guys. <laughs>